on one of them. Half court, half court. 18 Ed for the injury, East 184th and Walton Avenue. And yeah, if you're one of those people who like to do things by the book to an extreme measure, then good for you. Why do I say that? Because many times a person with experience is going to talk you out of doing the right thing because they want to cut corners. Matter of fact, I'm guilty of it. For example, if you want to start an IV and I see you using Betadine, I'm going to be like, oh my God, why is this person using Betadine? But as per the textbook, that's what it says you should do. So go ahead and do it. So I say that to say this, my people, whenever you're doing something by the book, whenever you're doing something the correct manner, you have to also consider that you're probably wasting time on something that needs a lot more uh, expeditious treatment. But regardless of the fact, if someone tries to correct you for doing the right thing, then they're absolutely wrong and you should not listen to them. Of course, there's easier ways to do things than there is expressed in the book. And there's things that you'll learn from doing in the street that you didn't necessarily learn in class. But regardless of the fact, do the things by the book. Use the book as a guide on how to proceed. And if someone, your partner, or anybody else tries to correct you or make fun of you because you're doing things by the book, then the hell with those people. Continue to do the right thing because... When it comes down time to it, no one's gonna no one's gonna protect you. The only thing that's gonna protect you is what you did and how you did it and your honesty. And if you're honest about doing things by the book and you show proof that you did, then you're in the clear. And I, I take time to say this because a lot of times new EMTs, new paramedics, they they unfortunately get guided down the wrong path by people with more experience. And on top of that, they're also scared about getting in trouble. They're also scared about killing a patient or doing the wrong thing. So if you're doing things by the book, then that takes away at least some of your fears. I hope this helps. Peace.